Hello Taurus, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So this reading is about Jupiter retrograde in Pisces and how this retrograde is going to affect your zodiac sign. Okay, uh, please note that this is a general reading, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. So Taurus uh, retrograde is happening from 29th of July till 24th of November. Okay. And uh, <clears throat> for you guys, Taurus will take place in the 11th house. What is retrograde, Taurus? So usually the planet keeps on moving forward. But in retro retrograde, the planet uh, spins backwards. Okay. And uh, what we are supposed to learn from this retrograde the foremost and the primary learning from this retrograde phase is to slow down. Why should we slow down, Taurus? What is the need to slow down? We need to slow down so that we can do some self-introspection. So that we can evaluate and re-evaluate certain things. Okay, We need to evaluate our approach towards people, situations. Uh, approach towards our goals towards our destiny towards our life purpose okay uh, we need to uh, this this retrograde phase is gonna give us certain chances or certain opportunities or rather I'll say necessary chances and necessary opportunities to bring the required changes in our life Okay, and that is why this phase is asking you to slow down. Okay, it is giving you an opportunity to grow. Right? So, Taurus, what I'm going to do is I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down. And in this reading, we'll see what is your energy going to be during this retrog uh, retrograde phase. Then we'll see how this uh, retrograde will impact your love life, your career, your finances, and your health. Okay. And please know that there is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in the description box and comment section. In the extended, uh, it is a it is a romance-based extended reading. We'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you. What action they will take towards you. What is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Okay. Right. So let's get started now. Just a couple of intuitive messages. Uh, Spirit wants me to convey some messages to you guys, Taurus. And one thing I feel is that your health is going to be really good during this retrograde phase. You're going to enjoy uh, really good health. You're going to feel energetic, quite positive during this phase. Also, Spirit want you guys to be careful about investing money in speculative business. Okay, like gambling. Or say, for example, if you are investing money in stock market or crypto without doing enough of research, then of course that, that activity becomes a speculative activity because you are taking a risk, you are taking a chance. Why it's a risk or a chance? Because you have not done enough of research. So such kind of activities, invest money into such activities very cautiously. If at all you want to, do, uh, if at all you want to invest money into such activities, into speculative activities, make sure you have done enough of research. Okay, your decision is backed by a solid research. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so let's get started now, Taurus. I'll shuffle the cards. I'll lay them down, and then we'll discuss the energies. So Taurus, what is your energy during this retrograde phase? Ten of Cups. Then we have Moon. Then we have Chariot. And we have Hermit. Wonderful. Uh, your energy during... Uh, how your love life will get impacted during this phase... Wheel of Fortune and King of Swords. What about career and your finances? We have Sun and we have Six of Pentacles. 
what about your health eight of wands and we have the queen of swords okay so let me show you your cards ten of cups the moon chariot and the hermit okay so this is your energy during the retrograde phase Hmm. So Taurus, what I feel is you'll have this urge or you'll have this desire to have right people in your life. You'll have this desire to meet your soul tribe. Okay. And you would rather prefer to remain alone than to entertain wrong people. So with the hermit card, I feel like you would rather prefer isolation than entertaining wrong people uh so when i say wrong people i mean people entering in your life with hidden intentions okay with the moon card you want to in fact distance yourself as much as possible from such kind of energies people with people with hidden intentions where you have you don't have enough of clarity regarding what kind of intention these people hold towards you you don't want to entertain such people in your life okay i also see that your manifestations to have a long term partner in your life okay those manifestations i mean you will sincerely manifest a long term partner in your life or you will make attempts to manifest you will make sincere attempts to manifest a long term partner in your life this this energy is all about people taurus the energy during the retrograde phase is all about people you wanting right people in your life you wanting soul tribe in your life you isolating yourself from wrong people okay you would prefer to stay alone rather than uh hanging out or dealing with the toxic energies or people with hidden intentions you would want to distance yourself as much as possible from wrong people you want to merge with your divine counterpart you want to find your divine counterpart so the desire to have your divine counterpart desire to have your long term partner will will only grow stronger and stronger every single passing day okay desire to have a family desire to have kids will only grow stronger i also see that during during this uh, retrograde phase you are going to become an adventurous person you would be in this energy where you would like to explore a lot explore play, explore places explore people explore different cultures uh, or even even like explore yourself so with a with a chariot card i'm getting this energy of wanting to explore the unknown you are setting out on a journey to explore different things okay different people different situations different places maybe you are trying to explore yourself you're feeling like uh i want to know myself more and more there is much more to discover about myself okay so there is this energy of explorer with the chariot card what how how it will impact your love life we have wheel of fortune and we have king of swords so uh i see a positive change in your love life okay you will be in good spirits and uh, you will feel energetic and you will have this urge to to have someone in your life a romantic partner in your life i told you right you're manifesting a long term partner in your life and and your manifestations are coming to fruition your manifestations are turning into reality for some of you you'll witness your manifestations becoming a reality during this phase with the wheel of fortune and with the king of swords i feel that 
you will be very protective about someone like there is a strong possibility that you're going to meet someone and you will realize instantly like this is this person has a potential to become a long-term partner of yours or you'll realize instantly like this is your long-term partner and you're going to be very protective about this connection like you will realize you are with the one is what i'm getting and that is why there is the strong protective energy as far as your as far as your uh, career and your finances are concerned we have uh, sun we have six of pentacles uh first of all i see that you're going to work very hard during this phase you are i mean you will have that motivation you will have that inspiration to work really hard and make the kind of money that you always wanted to make okay so if you have a target in your mind like by the end of the month this is the kind of money i'm going to make you will fulfill that target okay there is there is financial abundance that is coming your way and as a result of financial abundance there is a lot of happiness as well okay so taurus what i see is you have a certain target in your mind like this is what i want and this is how my financial position should be and this is the kind of per month income i want to make and uh, you will achieve that target okay whether you and if you are in in a job then there is a strong possibility that you will start another source of income during this uh, during this uh, retrograde phase it will sort of push you to achieve your financial goals this phase is going to push you to achieve your financial goals stars okay so by whichever way i see lot of financial stability and lot of financial abundance coming your way okay as far as your health is concerned we have eight of wands and we have queen of swords you have to take care of your throat a bit okay uh if you find yourself i mean i don't say you 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 do like this or you practice like this i mean if you find yourself yelling at someone okay don't do that it may impact your vocal cords your vocal cords are coming across as a bit sensitive during during this retrograde phase okay so i'm not saying that you you practice something like this or you usually yell at someone no no not at all but if at all during this phase you find yourself raising your voice or yelling at someone don't do that avoid doing that it may impact your vocal cords you have to take care of your throat is what i'm hearing uh other than that i see a very good other than that yes you have a very good health uh is what even during the intuitive messages i got that that you're going to enjoy a, a very good health and that is because you are going to take care of your health okay you will you will protect yourself from any uh, anything that may end up disturbing your health okay so you are someone who is very aware and you are someone Uh, who believes in taking precautionary measures okay rather than curing the disease you will you will always make sure that the disease uh, the disease never happens itself okay so you are very particular in taking precautionary measures and that is why i see that you are going to enjoy a, a very good health so apart from this minor thing of vocal cords or throat uh, it it may happen that for some of you you may have throat infection okay but it is going to be very minor again if you keep on drinking hot water continuously for 2 to 3 days yeah that may even go away you you won't even have to resort to medicines all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is likely conclusion between you and this person all right Take care of yourself and have a great time ahead. Bye bye Taurus.